Oh, guys. So a while back, I, I was gonna do a video about this, but I didn't, and then now I just decided that I should. A while back, I went on a date with this gentleman, and he seemed pretty cool, except, like, when we started to get to know each other more, he basically implied that he wanted to take things to the next level. I was like, oh, you mean relationship, right? And no, I was wrong. He was referring it like, the, the next sexual level. And I was like, no, like, we're not dating, and, like, come on, we should get to know each other more before we do that. And he basically told me, I want to test out the goods first before I make a purchase. As you can imagine, I was a little upset at first, and I was like, gee, you basically reduced me to, like, this freaking retail clearance item that you need to deem worthy before you decide to take in. And after I thought a while longer, I realized I shouldn't pity myself for being objectified. I should pity people like him who become so insecure that they believe that the only decent quality they possess is their sexual capabilities. And I feel like a lot of gay people lower themselves to that extent, when in fact they should realize that they, there is more to a human being than what they do in the sheets. And of course, when I expressed this to him, he ended up telling me that he knows that I would fall in love with him after we do it. And I was like, you know, that's not what a relationship is to me. That's not what love is to me. Love isn't being sexual and then discovering that, oh, you're the one for me. That's, that's not how it works. That's how it works when you are a teenager. I am not a teenager, and you sure as hell are not a teenager. I refused to be reduced to an object. If a guy wants me, he needs to learn that there is a lot more to me than that. Do not allow yourselves to be reduced to an object. Because you are worth so much more.